Hello everyone and welcome to this quick video on how I package my original artwork and commissions to send in the post. First I wrap the artwork up in cellophane to prevent it from getting wet or damaged while it's in the post and I use invisible tape just to stick it down nice and neatly. To ensure that the artwork doesn't get bent I like to sandwich it between two really strong pieces of cardboard and for this I like to reuse the boxes that my paper comes in from Jackson Art. They're really strong and they're flat so they're perfect for packaging artwork um, plus it's really good for the environment to reuse it and you don't have to spend extra money on packaging. All I do is I use a ruler and a pencil to draw on where I want to cut the cardboard and I usually leave about an inch around the artwork. Then I cut it with a box cutter and a mat underneath. I put some business cards inside because word of mouth marketing is so powerful for artists and then I also write a little thank you note to add a personal touch and just show how much I appreciate the support. Now it's time to put that all together so what I do is I put the two pieces of cardboard together and I tape all around the edges with just standard parcel tape and I tape it twice just so that it's reinforced and it's really strong. I then wrap that up in parcel paper so that it looks more finished and presentable. I was at the end of the roll at this stage so I had to improvise and cut two pieces up and stick it together because I don't like wasting. To finish it off, I pop a little bit of fragile tape around each side of the parcel and a sticker for the address and I write please do not bend in bold capital letters, um, even though it would be quite hard to bend it anyway but it's just for a precaution. I write the return address on the back just in case it gets sent back and that is it, that is the packaging finished, how I package my artwork to send in the mail. Please like this video if you found it useful and subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching.